Hey guys, welcome back to another video, and this time it's gonna be pretty epic because I've just bought a new car. But this isn't some ordinary new car. This isn't some new car that costs $20,000. No. This is a really expensive car. It's not a million dollars, but it's really expensive. So before I get started, don't forget to like and subscribe, and don't forget to join my Discord. The link will be in the description below. So my car is actually in the garage, so I'll go up there right now. Okay, so I'm going to give you five seconds to take a guess at what car this is because it's pretty special. Okay, here we go. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Look at this, it's a fully exposed carbon 4GT. So this is fully exposed carbon fiber with orange stripes down the middle. I don't think it can get any more sick than this because my old GT was orange all over the car but it had no carbon on it. This, it's fully exposed carbon with orange lines. It looks so cool. So I'm gonna go take it for a drive now because I kind of have to. So I'm gonna I'm gonna rev it right now. But this is a pretty amazing car. This is actually one of the most expensive. Actually, I think it's the second most expensive car I own. Look at this. Whoa, 7,000 RPM. 120, 140, 160, 180. Okay, this car is really fast. But yeah, my old Ford GT looked pretty cool in orange. But I reckon this thing looks a lot cooler with the carbon and orange. But look at this. I love the combination of the carbon and the orange. It just looks so cool. So yes, this did cost me $750,000, which is $250,000 more than the normal GT, just so I could have the whole carbon on the outside, but I think it looks amazing. So now I'm going to do a launch control, because I have to. Here we go. That's around two and a half seconds, 0 60. Whoa, okay, well... We're going 211 miles an hour, okay? I, I have to slow down now. So the car wasn't like this when I bought it. When I bought it, it had yellow stripes. That did look pretty cool because, I don't know, the blue stripes, it looked a bit too dark and it didn't really look too good with the carbon. But the yellow stripe looked pretty amazing. But the orange stripes, it's, it's on a whole new level. Also, the whole car is on a whole new level. The base GT with the paint, that looks really cool. But the carbon with the orange stripes, that is on... It's it's in a whole new universe, pretty much. Well, okay, we're going really fast. Brakes are amazing. I, okay, I'm going to go take this thing on the track now. Look at that diffuser, though. Two eighteen, two nineteen. Whoa, okay, we're going really fast. I think this goes two twenty six.
Okay, you guys can vote in the comments, but should this car become the new icon for the channel? So, when you guys search my channel on YouTube, the icon that pops up, should this car be there instead of the Lamborghini? I think it should. I think it's going to be, but you guys can vote in the comments. Four-wheel burnout. Wow, amazing brakes, tons of grip as usual. 180, 200 miles an hour. So next, Roblox Weekly Car Club Car Show. I am 100% bringing this car. This car is just so fast. This thing has so much grip. Okay, I have to do another acceleration test. Wow, 217, 218, 219, 220, 223, 226. Pretty sure I saw 226 there. So now I'm going to show you guys how I spec'd my GT. So I went to the Carbonio trim and I picked the tinted carbon 10 spoke. And then I went for these yellow stripes because those look pretty cool. The blue, I don't know, they just look too dark. Liquid gray would have been cool, but it doesn't give that cool accent. Red is nice, but the yellow was the best option. So then what I did was I went to the paint shop and I painted the stripes orange. So when you go into the paint shop there's a place where you can enter numbers so that is actually a color code i think so i'm going to show you guys right now so look right here it says r g and b you put 252 red 90 for green and three for blue and the shine is 11 percent so in case you guys had one of these and you want to paint it like mine then that's how i did it So now I'm going to show you guys the blinkers. Here we go. Wow, actually, those are really cool. Look at these. So the lights, when you turn them on, they're red. But the brake lights are orange. Look, it's a different shade. It's actually a different shade of red. One is red and the other one's kind of red-orange. Wow, but this car is completely savage. Well, I've already used half a tank of gas just by driving around. Mind you, I have been on the rev limiter pretty much the whole time. So yeah, this is my new car. I absolutely love it. I think it looks amazing with the carbon and the orange stripes. This is probably the sickest car in my garage. So yeah, you know, I think I'm going to end this video here. Thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And do not forget to join my Discord. The link will be in the description as always. And I'll see you in the next video.